Hello everyone, welcome back to Electronic Embers. Today we're playing some more West of Loathing. Uh, before we get started, if you could like the video, comment in the section below, subscribe, hit the bell so you don't miss anything in the future, that'd be great, it would help me out, and I would much appreciate it. And, just so, if we can get it to work, uh, up in the top right corner, that way, there should be something popping up, exclamation point, of some kind. Uh, asking what game you want to see in the future. So, I don't quite know how those work, but we're going to try it because we're trying new things these days. So, without further ado, let's get started. See uh, where we left off. I think we were just wandering around. Uh, anywhere saying new? Oh, this place. Let's go there. Da -da -da. As you're riding towards your destination, you pass by a building in which a barn dance is happening. I guess that it makes it. I guess that makes it a barn. What? Okay, the people inside seem to be having a good time. Ah, uh, we'll join in. You mosey in and have a grand old time at the ba barn dance. You even learn a few new moves. Most of the moves involve pretending to reel someone in from across the room with a lasso, but they're still new moves. Go to the store. The one behind the counter stares at you with a huge grin on her face. She gestures it's good she's got for sale. I'm gonna take a look at that. That person's goods. Event, advanced cow punching. Wow. I'm the craziest cow puncher in these parts, so gotta keep up my my reputation. Cookbook. Oh, that's a lot. Ah, I got a lot. We're good. Uh, I don't need soap. Hammer. Do I have a hammer? Hammer? We got nails. Oh, I don't have enough meat. Oh, there's a needle. For that lock picking nonsense I can't do earlier. Alright. Anything hidden here? Oh, oh my goodness. Just kind of like jumped around. All right. Just getting stabbed. Oh my god. Oh my god. Getting stabbed by all of them. Okay. Well, I guess there's nothing here. Let's go over to the Dave Yard. Oh, I don't even have to read that. It says fight something. We're fighting them. Wouldn't call that a fight. Oh, wait, I was already here. Is this where I could fight endless endless things? Yeah. Yeah, I was here for a long time. We don't, we don't need to be back here. Man, I don't even know. You notice a trail of burnt vegetation off the side of the trail. We I mean, thing. A hell calf. I'm fighting down hell calves. One hit in Hellcast. Oh, we were at the fort, too. Oh, I can pick locks. Nice. Ooh, this guy. The goblin seated at the desk is repeatedly firing his pistol at the pie save. Get their attention, get their attention with violence. Yeah, well, we're committed at this point. Violence solves everything in the West. Shoot him. Shoot him dead. He's trying, but he can't. General Gobb's hat and pistol. Hooray! Oh, a lead pie. I think I already, I already did everything here. Okay, well. Let's go back to the town then. 
Come on, crazy horse. Oh. I didn't notice that said new earlier. As you just mount and approach the house where the bandits are holed up, you hear a voice from inside say, What was that? Looks like you're gonna have to be sneaky if you wanna avoid a full on. Alright, I'm not even gonna try. I know I might have looked dumb. I don't know what that word is. Oh, yeah, Sneaky's my middle name. Let's do this. Oh, look at me go. Tiptoeing around. Ow. In the sound of it, you say the doghouse contains an angry dog. Very funny. Fight him! Oh, they're all so... They think they're so funny. I'm pretty sure this one shot would take these guys down. Buy them! Oh. I'm too quick. Does it gang gun boots? Bag of ears. What are these guys doing? Perk mosey something. Can I get in there? What's my inventory say? You got books and such, right? Books. Read. Yeah. Read some some cow punching. Ooh, a new attack. Increase maximum hit points. Reduce the muscle of all your opponents. Increases your maximum AP by two. Well, wow, that's that's the best. All right, well, there's something else here. Let's go like a dirt water. Ooh, silversmith house. This is how we smith some. Three bullets. Yeah, let's make some bullets. Total four bullets. Oh, I could have made a needle. Yes. I need needles. See? That's exactly why I need them. Yeah, I don't know if safe cracking. Selling fakes! Oh my god. So we're gonna go to the silver platter place that we found. Oh, Spittoon. Oh yeah, we're investigating that Spittoon. It might be a bedpan. That'd be way worse. It feels like you maybe aren't getting what I'm saying. We're talking about an object that someone probably uses when they wake up in the middle of the night and can't be bothered to walk to the outhouse. And the best you can hope for is that maybe that only use it to spit nighttime tobacco juice into. In which case, it's only full of rancid, congealed tobacco spit. Uh, are you even listening to me? Or are you sort of skimming past the text? Bedpan. Bedpan. Okay, fine. Have it your way. Your own filthy, disgusting way. It turns out to probably not be a bedpan, but it is definitely a spittoon, and it is definitely filled with rotting brown spit. Dig in there. What is wrong with you? Bite me! Oh, good God. Okay, you plunge your hand in up to the wrist. It makes a gloop sound and breaks the thin skin of congealed toxins that was previously keeping the dire smell in relative check. Now you're choking in a misama of... I hope that's how you say that. Of oily, bitter chaw stink. You know that feeling you get when you're about to puke? How you get the taste in the back? Way back in the rear corners of your mouth, that metallic tang by the root of your tongue, like you're sucking on a corroded old penny. Just tell me what I found. You found a filthy, slime-covered old brooch. Are you happy? I bet you're going to put it on without even washing it first. Look at the stats on that. 
We did good, guys. We did good. I'm gonna harvest some cactus bits. Right, let's get back on old crazy horse. And, uh, where's the place we found? Oh, it's way up there. You found a pair of saddlebags slung over a tree branch. It's property of Fort All Dead Library. Dig through the bags. More cow punching books. All right, we're gonna be the best. Let's go ahead and get better at cow punching. Learn the old one, two, three skill that lets you perform three punch attacks in the quickest session. Well, of course, the other two we already read. They're the same as the last one. What are my options? Oh, you're gonna put silver plating on my hat? No, I don't I don't want that. That's not what I want to use all my meat for. Well, I'm disappointed. Let's wander around a little bit. Lazy a dude ranch. Let's go there. It's back up there, that's not even where I was wandering. Needle in a haystack. Nailed it. You got a lock and ranch dressing. Strange things to keep together. So an herbal remedy. Care to buy it? The kind gifted us by Gaia. Mother Gaia. Sure. Herbs. Herbal. Essence. Oh, it's a garden. Let's go over to the garden. Oh, I was lied to. It's just a bunch of weeds. Ugh. Do you have anything for me? What's happening? Neat. Oh, I'll buy this person's hat. Oh. I guess they just told me where they got the hat. We're not making a lot of progress in the story here. Uh, if you want to comment down in the section below where I'm actually supposed to go to progress story. Wow, look at those cows. Look at those cows. Okay. Uh, that'd be great, because it's <laughs> I'm not getting anywhere. Oh, that's not what I thought I was going to do. But I locked out. I punched that cow so hard, I locked it down for two turns. This is what I wanted to do. The old one, two, three. Nailed it. Bam. I'm going to do a normal, normal attack on this cow. Bam. Fort all dead. Oh no. He didn't seem to notice you. Sorry about that. Pardon, pardon, pardon. Excuse me, excuse me. Sorry about that. Well, I mean, we're, we're tracing a necromancer, right? If I'm in a. Let me flush a bunch of toilets. Um, isn't that where I'm supposed to go? stuff too, so I'm really helping the cause if I have to fight them later. Yep. Nothing over here. Stench resistance. I don't have oh my goodness, another pentagram. Next text. It seems to be written by one of the necromancer's cultists. He and several others were remaining, reanimating the dead soldiers here on the theory that the best undead army would be a literal undead army. The hitch in the plan came when they raised 
the officers who decided they weren't going to take orders from a bunch of weirdo civilians. The last entry suggests Arthur and his cohorts were planning on abandoning their station and reporting back to the Necromancer. The entry ends abruptly in the middle of a sentence. Fascinating. Nope. Can I do anything with this since I have... No. Oh, wait. This one seems pretty dangerous. Are you sure you want to read it? Yeah. Whatever, Grandma. You cannot see the words on the page, but you nonetheless read them. Your mind becomes stained with grim secrets. You've got a skill. Grin and skull. As you turn on the last page, your book vanishes in a puff of black smoke. Ooh, spooky. It's time you start gathering clues about the whole perm permbolent deaths situation. That's going to be around these parts. Oh, Necromancer's Journal. You open the Necromancer's Journal and examine the information you've collected so far. You found the note about ley lines, but you don't really know what they are. You found someone to help, somebody smart, somebody who knows a lot about magic. Hmm. Looks like that's everything you've got so far. You're smart and no stuff. Holy goddamn. Alright, any ideas? Oh, we're gonna poison them? Part of vaccinations. Oh, well, how do we do that? Tell me. What do you think we should do next? You got all that tea, tea, tea? Maybe we can take it back to the goblins that stole it. Gustav and Gulch, I think he said. Dynamite Dan had a ton of stuff. Alright, so. Well. Let's see. It's Gustavo Gulch. Oh yeah, we're fighting it. No goblin is getting out of this place alive. Oh, that's 36 times 3. I thought it was just... I did 40 damage all of a sudden. That's even better. Nothing. <sighs> all that... TNT. Where was it? Just in here, right? Oh, I can pick this now. Look at all that meat. Oh, engagement rings and tiaras. Uh, I like my current get up. Well, there was a whole bunch of not TNT here, so. Alright, well, I think I'm going to end this one here. Um, in the comments below, let me know where I'm supposed to go to actually progress the story. I could look it up, but having your guys' help sounds even better. So let me know what you want me to see me do, where I should investigate. Maybe don't give me all the spoilers, but uh, tell me where you'd like me to go starting off in the next one so I have a, a plan, not just wandering around the West and punching things and getting spooked up by, by demons and such. But yeah, all right, so thank you for watching. Uh, like I said, let me know in the comments below where they go. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Ring the bell so you don't miss anything, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.